Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, both here in beautiful, historic Dublin, Ireland, and also out on the inner tubes. Those folks uh, joining us today through the conference app. Uh, my name's Krobe. I will be your master of ceremonies for today. The Goose and I will help shepherd our speakers on and off the stage and kind of help give you some exciting information. So I want to say uh, welcome to our in-person event. Uh, anyone that made it here, thank you very much. Everyone on the internet, thank you. Uh, this is our first ever OpenSSF Day uh, EU. And I want to thank everyone so, so much for joining us, taking time out of your busy days. And I wanted to say, Zhiguich. That's an awesome code of conduct slide. <laughs> That's very informative. Uh, so I would like everyone, please, to familiarize yourself with the Code of Conduct. It applies to everyone, speakers, staff, uh, virtual folks, and in-person attendees. If you have any questions regarding the behavior at this event, please contact a member of LF staff right away. Um, we also want to make sure that everyone is as comfortable as possible in this space. I know some of us haven't been used to close proximity in a while. So please be mindful of others' personal spaces. There are color-coded stickers that go on your badges that kind of give a clue as to what level of personal interaction you're uh, comfortable with. And there are also pronoun stickers uh, to help make it clear how to address your fellow attendees. I'm going to go to the amazingly informative health and safety slide. Please take a moment to review this. <laughs> um, as a reminder, uh, there are protocols we will be following today while indoors. Please wear your masks at all times unless you're actively eating or drinking. Speakers uh, also may remove their masks at the podium. Oh man. And you may remove your mask outdoors. If you refuse to wear a mask, you will be asked to leave. So please keep that in mind. Is there an awesome cell phone reminder? Great. Oh, that's not a cell phone reminder. Uh, <laughs> At the first day of the conference week is always very exciting. You know, it's nice to see old friends make new friends, but we want to make sure that people that are here to listen to the speakers um, get that maximum ability to enjoy that. So we have a full house today. So out of respect for your speakers, please make sure you silence your phones. If you're having an amazing conversation in between any of these talks, please take that outside to keep this room as quiet as possible so those others in the room can help provide their full attention. And also, please keep the doorway area clear and closed during our sessions. If you need to step out for the restroom, the facilities are left or right. You may go left or right for the facilities if you need to refresh yourselves. Uh, for YouTube, if you need to step away during a in about two weeks, uh, speakers may also make their talk slides available uh, after the conference, and you would go to the schedule page on the website to access that. Food throughout the day, we're going to have some awesome coffee and tea and water and snacks out in the hall. Lunch is on your own, which is good and bad. It's, it's sad that we can't eat together, but there's amazing restaurants here in Dublin area, all within a bunch within about five or so minute walk. So please avail yourself of the local cuisine. Uh, Wi-Fi is on the back of your badges. And I think we'll have a slide in a little bit if you're old like me and you can't read the little print on the back of the badge, we'll have a slide that has it in giant letters for you. Our sponsor, uh, if you haven't guessed, our friends at Sonotype are sponsoring the event today. The Sonotype team has really gotten involved in the OpenSSF and all the working groups and many of the projects. We really appreciate their support. So let's take a moment and let's thank our sponsors. Thank you, Sonotype. Here's a preview of the agenda. <laughs> we have an action-packed day today, and we're ready to talk about everything from security education to support, you know, uh, securing and identifying critical projects to supporting our maintainers. We'll also be talking about new investments in securing language ecosystems. And we're going to dive into why it's important and why the business community is investing in the OpenSSF efforts, 
projects like Alpha and Omega, SigStore, and of course the mobilization plan. There's going to be some amazing announcements today, both here in the room and on the internet, so keep an eye on your phones for all the amazing things we'll be releasing today. Uh, breakout sessions. So after we held this event in Austin, a lot of people asked for more opportunities to have that one-on-one -on -one individual collaboration with folks in the room. So you know, we wanted to give people a chance to dive deeper into topics they're interested in. So we're going to have a miniature unconference, so to speak, where we're going to divide the room into four breakout sessions later in the day. And they'll all be led by you all which will be pretty amazing. So if you have an idea for a breakout session that's related to the OpenSSF, um, my friend Khalil here is going to have, um, we have some markers posted at the whiteboards uh, up, just up here in the front of the room. So when we're on a break, if you have an idea of something you want to talk about, please feel free to walk up to the whiteboard, the little uh, pad, write your idea, please give us your name. And uh, we'll, at the end of the break, we will review, and afterwards we'll have a vote. Everyone will have a chance to vote for the sessions, and the sessions that have the most votes will be how we divide up our unconference sessions. And that be during the first break, we'll have the vote. And we'll be dividing up into four teams a little bit later today. Now, with all that business settled, all the nonsense and amazing slideware, um, I would like to introduce uh, our first presenters. First, we're going to have Brian Bellendorf. He is the general manager for the OpenSSF. He's been leading the OpenSSF since October last year. Before that, he led the Hyperledger Foundation for five years. And another initiative, Hyperledger is another initiative hosted by the Linux Foundation. They had a day yesterday, if you missed that. Um, prior to that, Brian has had a long history of open source software and open technology communities, along with everything from founding open source projects like Apache, and the open source initiative to following founding startups and then working at the uh, US White House and the World Economic Forum. Please join me in welcoming Brian Bellendorf for our first keynote. And he's going to talk about what the OpenSSF is up to. Brian. Thank you. 